Hi, welcome to the Virtual Art Corner. Today what we're going to do is we're going to make a chain of paper dolls. Let's go have some fun. Today we're going to start out with a piece of paper, something to write with, scissors, and glue. Uh, we're also going to use some paper if you wanted to make some clothes for your paper dolls as well. I'm going to start by folding my paper vertically, otherwise known as the hot dog way. Uh, and then what I'm going to do is I'm going to open it back up and along the fold here I'm going to cut it. So I'm going to cut this lengthwise so that I have two long rectangles. Once I have it cut then what I'm going to do is I'm going to glue along the short side of the rectangle. So I don't want to use a whole lot of glue because I want it to dry quickly. So I'm going to go ahead and put some glue on the edge and then I will go ahead and glue them together. The next step is going to be um, what's called doing an accordion fold. So I'm going to start by folding the edge over like this so that it's a smaller rectangle and then I'm going to flip my paper over and I'm going to fold it the opposite direction. I'm always going to line up the edges so that they're all the same size. I don't want smaller rectangles and then bigger rectangles. I want them all to be the same size and I want them to line up with each other. So I'm very careful that the tops and the bottoms line up and that the edges also line up. Once I have them all folded, then I might have some extras that will hang off the side. If that happens, then what I'm going to do is just cut that off. Alright, so now that I have them all folded and all set to go, I'm going to grab something to draw with and I'm going to start on the side of my paper. And I'm going to start by drawing the top of the arm, then the head, and then the top of the other arm. After I get that done, then I'm going to draw the bottom of the arm down to my legs so that it almost looks a little bit like a gingerbread man. Alright, once I have that done, then I can go ahead and cut them out. So now that I have them cut out, you can see that they look like little people. So I can go ahead and use my scrap paper in order to make clothes for them or I could even just draw on right onto the paper dolls whichever you would like to do. You can also put faces on them. Uh, you can use whatever you'd like in order to do this. Uh, I'm even going to use a little scrap of paper and I'm going to cut out some hair for my paper dolls as well. You can decorate these however you like. You can make them boys or girls or you can um, or you can go ahead and make them bears or, or all sorts of different things that you would like to do. Uh, this is a whole lot of fun, so hopefully you will go ahead and make some paper dolls for yourself. Have fun! See you soon!